Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Pete here, and I haven't done a fragrance review in like forever, probably about a year or so, but I'm back, and um, I'm going to be doing reviews here slowly but surely. Um, I took some time off because, you know, I had like an injury to my foot, and I've been off work for a couple weeks, but I figured I'd use this time here to go ahead and do a review or two. Or three or four <laughs> um, I want to give a quick shout out to 860 Cologne um, you guys probably seen his videos he's the one that has the voice sounds like an announcer from for, for for a game or something like that a game show announcer or something like that but he has a good voice for announcing fragrances and and he gets into the details with his colognes and fragrances also uh, the fragrance that I want to review today is one that 860 Cologne reviewed and, and inspired me to review it as well and the fragrance is none other than Eternity Summer for Men 2014. I'll get into the notes here. Your top notes you have are juniper berries, pear, watermelon, and basil. Now for your mid notes, you have cardamom, lavender, thyme, and in the base, you have amber, sandalwood, and musk. Here's the box. I brought this from eBay. I think it was like 20, 25 bucks. I got an eBay. Uh, I'm sure it's not a bootleg one. I took the cellophane off. Um, there was no code here even with the cellophane. It looks pretty authentic here. Eternity. Summer. Here's the box. They only come in one size, which is a 3.4 ounce. There it is. The bottle presentation. Looks kind of frosty. Uh... In the bottom right here, there's a code called 4038. There is a code right there if you can zoom in and check that out. 4038. Like I said, the bottle's frosty. The juice is clear. Spray works pretty good. 3.4 ounce. I got it, like I said, for about 25 bucks on eBay. It's, it's about a year old, so that's probably why it's not that expensive right now. Um, but nonetheless, my first impression when I sprayed it, I picked up the pear. And I went up with like sugar all over, like a very sweet candy pear, uh, pear candy, if you would, with, with watermelon mixed into that. Um, the juniper berries, I didn't really pick up because I really haven't smelled a juniper berry in my life. So I can't say, oh, this has juniper berry. It doesn't because I don't know what it is. But it has a very clean, fresh smell of sugar and candy and fruits. Smells very good. I know uh, 860 Cologne said it smelled like the Smarties candy. And I can see where he came from with that because it does kind of remind me of that some sort. It does have that candy or smell to it, which I understand where he came from with that. And, and I can see what he meant by that too. Um, nonetheless, this is a great fragrance. Like I said, it's for summer. Duh. It says it on the bottle. Age-wise, I would say teenagers and above can pull this off. The longevity on this is not great. That's the only thing that I, the problem that I have with this fragrance and with a lot of Eternity fragrances that they don't last as much. On my skin, I tested out a couple of days ago and I wore it all day. I put four sprays on and it lasted me about three hours, maybe three and a half hours. And then I had to find myself reapplying again. But nonetheless, the fragrance itself is fresh. Like I said, it opens up with that candy smell and it pretty much stays that way for me on my skin. It stays sweet, sugary candy smell. And it's supposed to evoke somebody walking on the beach, taking a nice walk on a summer day. And I can also see where, where that came from. It does remind me of being outside in front of the water. It does smell good. Um, I think Calvin Klein did um, get that feeling in this bottle and in, in the fragrance as well. It, it, it does remind me of the summer. It has that fresh summery vibe to it that you would like. And um, it, it's not bad for the price. Now, the only reason why I can see people not wanting this, as we mentioned before with some reviewers, is that maybe the longevity. Some people like beastly smells for the summer, but being that it's hot out and sticky, you really don't want to project too bad. You don't want to wear something that has the projection of like Lamal or something like that. So this is pretty good for me and I like it. And give it a try guys, you might like it as well. That's the Eternity Summer for Men 2014. Has a great smell. Um, you're not gonna kick yourself in the behind for it, for spending 20, 30 bucks for it on eBay. 
But if you can find anywhere else, go ahead and get it. Check it out, guys. This has been Pete with a fragrance review. Peace out. Take care.